Just over four hours drive. We have made it to Alice Springs. We'll see you at the caravan park and give you all the details. Welcome to Discovery Parks at Alice Springs. We're staying at the park that's down Palm Place. Let's make sure we don't hit anything. This is it. We're going to turn right. Nice little play area or something going on down there. Oh, a couple of, got how many? Four pools or something. Look at this. Four pools. One, two, three, four pools. And no one's in them. Yeah, they must be freezing. It's meant to be a nice 32 degrees here shortly. It's currently 27 by the car. So you got all your on-site cabins and everything here as well. And we're gonna turn down this one. That's number 26. What number are we, Caster? 24. 24. Twenty-six. There's twenty-seven, twenty-eight opposite us. Could even, could even get a drive-through. Yep, twenty-four. That's us. Hmm. All right, we're going to unhook and then explore Alice. Good morning from Alice Springs Desert Park. We're running a little late today. We're trying to make the nine o'clock bird show. It's almost quarter to nine. So we're just gonna quickly go straight to the bird show as soon as we get in. And then on to see all the other animals. It's just on the other side of the main town or on the town centre. About 10 or so minutes from the caravan park. All right, we're inside Desert Park now. I think the bird show starts at 10 o'clock. You gotta be 15 minutes before that. So we do have a bit of time on my hands now. <laughs> $37.50 for adults. Children were $18.50. They do have family saver, savers. One adult, two children, two adults, one child, things like that. Uh, five and under are free. I think it's five to 16 year old for children. Oh, see what's here. What a backdrop to the desert park. The That's why they made it. There's a little bit of wind around. It's actually windier on the other side when we woke up this morning. So I think that's the thing, we're getting a little bit of shelter. Might be. All right, let's go see. The uh, desert park was a bit of a fizzer in our opinion yesterday. Apart from Reuben giving a nice Aboriginal talk, bit of history and some uh, cultural information, which was good. But today we have ventured out to Allery Creek or Big Hole, West McDonald National Park. Creek. Uh, it's about 91 
one kilometres from the caravan park and you've got about two kilometres of corrugations which we're going along now which should be pretty exciting let's get in there and have a look So you can camp here, as we just showed you there, there's the campgrounds. I'm not sure how many spots they've got, but you will need to book prior to coming. It's uh, actually booked out at the minute for the next couple of days. Just head to the NT Government Parks uh, website to book your site. And looks like once again you need Optus for your internet etc and it looked like they did have a satellite dish to maybe pick up some TV reception out here as well so we're gonna get a we're gonna find a park all right here we are Ellery Creek big hole how far do we have to go Dolomite walk 3k Laro Pinta Trail. Yeah. Anyway, that's well, you're far. here, and there <laughs> it is. <laughs> Couple hundred meters, maybe. Oh, that was cold. All right, let's get to Ellery. From all reports, it is freezing, and it's two, three, oh, maybe three or four hundred meters to. Uh, get through a little chasm and around the corner to a nice sandy beach been given the hot tip so we didn't put the weddy on we're just gonna brave it it's actually only 23 or 24 at the minute as well so we'll try and swim through there and get around the corner and show you guys what it's what it looks like around there Well, here we are, Hallery Creek Big Hole. Looks like I'm going to be the only lunatic swimming today. I don't think anyone else is on the other side there. It's pretty deep. Oh, this is going to be fresh. All right, we're going in. It's pretty cold, yeah. Woo! Grab the other noodle. Oh, yeah, it's fresh, all right. Halfway. We'll have a look at it. Well, just have a look at this. Got an amphitheater in here. Almost made it to the sandbank. And there's just these, uh, just these rock ledges and rock platforms in, in the middle here.
Well, made it. Definitely worth the swim. I don't know how cold this water is, but it gives you the sting as you swim through. But have a look at that. Not one other person here. Mallory Creek Big Hole. Get down here and check it out for yourselves. It's got the barbecue facilities. You can camp here. And just enjoy the scenery. How good was Ellery Creek Big Hole? Definitely get yourself to that one. We just come back down the road, oh, I think it's about 40k back towards Alice and Simpsons Gap. We're just coming up to it now. So a few barbecues and picnic areas. Park's open 5am till 8pm. And it's just 8 kilometres off the main highway. And about 30 odd k's out of Alice. This is Simpsons Gap. Just amazing rock formations and everything in Alice. It's unbelievable. Alright, let's go check it out. Simpsons Gap. There's the dude star climbing trees. There is a path that you can walk along. Somehow we just ended up in the riverbed here. But this is it. Nice and cool now. As I said at Ellery, it's only uh, it's only meant to be 27 or something today. I was only 24 or 25 before. So it's a coolish day, which is a bit of welcome relief, to be honest. Maybe let's get on this path now and walk through this last little bit. You can't swim here, obviously, it's just stagnant water. Just a quick look, nice easy walk. There we go, back on the path. That's since Simpsons Gap. We'll head back to Alice, back to the caravan park, and get ready to keep making our trip down south. Next stop, Uluru, Ayers Rock. 
We've never seen it before. So we can't wait to get down there. Morning from the Alice. We've just left Alice Springs Discovery Park. Highly recommend the Discovery Park. Clean, everyone's friendly. You got the carts there. They're gonna redo the uh, water slide. Three pools, Four. games room, entertainment room couple of jumping pillows so so plenty to see and do um, toilets dump point the whole work so really recommend that we're about just about ready to jump on the Stewart Highway we're gonna stop off at Curtin Springs for the night for a free camp they got the pub there and some drinking water etc but it's uh, generally no power unless you want to pay for power and then off to Uluru so till then, we'll see you at Curtin Springs, show you around, and then on to Uluru. Let's go!